you are a passenger. Stay over there and, and pass passage. <laughs> I'm a passenger. <laughs> I'm a passenger, so I better pass it. <laughs>
<laughs> but see this bike right here for 149. Yeah, I need a big seat. <laughs> sure do. I'm tell if you haven't ridden a bike in a while, try riding one as an adult and see don't you get diaper ass or whatever they call it. What they call it? <laughs> Donald wants me to get that one, but I'm not getting it. It's cute and all. I like that army green. See that one? And then he can get either this one. I don't know if that's a lady's bike or not though. It doesn't look like it. It says men. Oh, it says men? Yeah. Okay, so we found our bikes that we're gonna get. <laughs> that we're gonna get, but like I say, we're gonna go over to. Uh, what camp? Fort, yeah, I, I lost my train of thought. We're gonna go over to Fort Campbell and see what they have to offer. But these are really good bikes that they have in here, though. So we can get two bikes for three hundred dollars instead of paying eight hundred dollars for a bike. We're not doing that. The reason why Donald want me to get this one because if you could see right here that curve since I had that knee surgery and stuff, it would be best, but I think I can do that one. Right? They call that a, a senior step through. This little bend down like that for so, older people with bad knees they can just step right through. You but then I won't things. match you. <laughs> oh, you can get that white one up there. Is that a man's bike? Yes. It's not a law that we have to have matching bikes. It's not. But I want us to. <laughs> no, we'll just see if um, what they have at the yeah, other we'll see what they have for camera. For me to see it. Okay. Guys, look what I found. I like our nest. Isn't that cute? Oh, bless this home. We can't go wrong. The accent pill, and they're only twelve dollars each. I know we didn't come here for this. <laughs> but what do you think? We'll just wait. We'll, we'll wait till we come back. Okay. When we're on our way home. But boy, those pillows are cute. I do like our nest. I like our nest. It matches our day trip, our day decor. Anyway, guys, I stopped in Smoothie King and I got the um, strawberry banana. It's called the angel food. And they claim that this thing here is only 300 calories. I know they mind, but it sounds good. Could be. It's really some I love strawberry and banana together for some reason. I just I've always loved it so good but it's too sweet i can't drink it no. it's too sweet you don't want it mm -mm. normally when we come to uh smoothie king down will always get the chocolate i get some kind of like protein with almond milk so yeah almond... it's like a chocolate something yeah yeah i i i don't remember this being so sweet like lately i can't stand sweet Anyway, guys, so we stopped at Fort Campbell. Fort, uh, I mean, Scott, Scott Air Force Base. And then I showed you guys my cute little walking shoes. I got those from Amazon. <laughs> These are a knockoff of Skeletos. But let me tell you, ladies, if you want a comfortable shoe, this shoe is light, airy, and very comfortable. I will provide a link in the description just in case you want to try them. I'm telling you. I used to wear these when we were over in Germany a lot. The the brand was Vibram. Vibram. And they were like 90 to 100 and something dollars. But these were like less than 50. But I'm telling you, if you're looking for a shoe to just walk around in, nice, comfortable shoe, it feels like you're walking around with your socks on. You will love these shoes. Anyway. We will see you at our next stop. There you go. Y'all see, he keep trying to start the truck up. He don't want to no, start I, it up. No, I need some air. Yeah, I just need some air or something. So I just rolled the window down a little bit. Yeah. I don't want to interrupt the show. I don't want to. What a show. <laughs> yeah. All right, guys. So we will see you at the next stop. 
Hey guys, so things have taken a turn for the worse and I'm trying to keep smiling here, but I'm telling you what, I am so, so, so upset. So the Ford dealership that Donald bought his truck from, they were supposed to put this little thingy in his car for the brake to work on the haul part of his truck. And they kept telling us, oh, we're going to call you. We're going to call you. Definitely be done by Tuesday. I know you pick your trailer up Tuesday. Don't worry about it. So they kept putting it off. And Donald was like, look, this is not good enough. So he talked to one of the supervisors up there. And he comes back and he's like, oh, I'm sorry to tell you we don't have any more. So it'll be a week to 10 days before the part comes in before the part comes in and I'm like y'all knew this a week ago like why didn't you order the part a week ago so right now we're trying to salvage this day so I'm very upset so we paid for two uh, RV parts and we won't be able to use either one so Donald thinks he has a workaround I'm not optimistic, so I just hate when you get bad news. <laughs> it's just like I want to go lay down and cry. But anyway, I don't know how things are going to turn around for us. We've been calling around. If he doesn't get this part put in his car, we can't use our trailer for two weeks but the good thing is they will store our trailer for two weeks so I'm not happy right now things happen I mean it'll it'll happen it's because we're not like I say we're not leaving for another six weeks at least so we'll still have a chance to do everything we need to do with the car you see Donald is quiet because he is just like, I'm going up there and they're going to loan me a truck to pull my trailer and we're going camping. And I'm just like, I don't think they're going to do it, but I don't want to fight with him. So I'm just going to be quiet and talking it out makes me feel better. See, I feel better already. I feel better already. Things are going to work out. All things are positive vibes, people, positive vibes. That's all I can say. <laughs> my mentality is this. And if you watch anybody's YouTube channel, you're gonna realize you're gonna run into all kind of stuff that you. Well, we know. Yeah. We know. So I just feel like this is just one of those one of those options, and uh. Well, life. It ain't life gotta happens, be a YouTube yeah. channel, but life yeah. happens, and you're gonna get disappointments. But I hate that they kept telling us. Yeah. Oh, we'll have it done. We'll have it done. I'm like, did you not even know that you didn't have the part in, and you just gonna wait until he gets there and be like, oh. We don't have a part. I'm yeah. like, that's crazy. If Donald hadn't called the boss yesterday, they probably wouldn't have told us until Tuesday. Yeah. I'm gonna let Donald handle this one. I'm gonna bow out gracefully. <laughs> I'm going to bow out gracefully. But we haven't eaten anything since breakfast this morning, so we already went to our hotel room and I sanitized it like it's a big film of Lysol in there. Just a big puffy smoke of Lysol. Yeah, we couldn't like, stay in there. <laughs> well, that's I what I do to every hotel room yeah. we get, though. I spray it down real then good. Don't play, and then don't play, y'all. We leave for a little while and let that air out a bit. And then we'll go back to the room. And it's been a full day. So I am going to... I'm, I'm telling you, like, we're just assuming things are going to go well. I don't know where we thought we were. Because we got on the highway and Donald was like, uh, we didn't even reserve a hotel. And I'm like, well, let's just hope, because it's a Wednesday, let's just hope they have room. And so he got in there and the guy was like, we have one room left. Now, I believe he lied, but whatever. That's what's going on right now. Like I said, I was frustrated until I started talking about it. So now I feel a little better because things could be worse you know what I'm saying so this this is just a little hurdle living this kind of lifestyle you have to expect things to not go well because as you watch the videos you see people run into 
you know, hurdle after hurdle after hurdle. And so I'm just going to have to adjust my attitude. That's what I'm going to do. I'm going to adjust my attitude. Get it together, baby. Get it together. <laughs> Alright, so we are inside the food court and I am going to get a Popeye sandwich, I think. Yep, if they have it, I'm going to get a Popeye sandwich. Okay, Donald, what did you get? I got chicken teriyaki, Japanese style. I'm going to show y'all his meal. It looks good. He said it doesn't taste as good as it looks. It's not bad though. It's not bad. Yeah, use the you MSG. Get, it doesn't have you, MSG in it. Would you get to? Uh, would you get to drink? drink? I get anything. Cause they're get, you have to get a can soda now. They don't give. Oh. So he ate at a place called Ming Tree. No, mine is on the side. Oh, it's on the side. It's Sakura. Oh. Yeah, Ming Tree is Chinese. Okay, and then we have Burger King and all those places over there. Good. So I got the Popeye's um, fish sandwich. I'm going to try the Cajun fish sandwich and see what it tastes like. So I'll let you guys know what I think. Alrighty. Okay, guys. This is where we're staying on post. So this is what the hotel is like. Hey, how y'all doing? And I don't know if y'all do this, but when men, I, now you can tell we've already been in here. I sprayed the sheets and everything down. But when Donald and I come to a hotel, so we always sleep in our own separate beds when we come to a hotel room. I'm sure he gonna sneak over here by the end of the night. He act like he can't stand to be away from his wife. <laughs> okay guys so i wanted to share with you this is the popeye's cajun flounder sandwich this is the cajun one spicy one so i wanted to try it for a while and this is what it looks like so it's got a couple pickles on it and some kind of sauce or something i'm just gonna take a bite of it let you know what i think Okay, so first of all, they put chicken on the flounder sandwich. They put what? This is chicken, this is not fish. That's chicken? This is chicken. Okay, well that's... <laughs> I'm upset, but okay. <clears throat> so, okay. Yeah. I'm telling you, this day has been, I'm gonna start over tomorrow. Thank you guys for watching. It's been a pleasure sharing my day with you. And I'll see you in the next vlog. Have a blessed day. Good night.